So I'm cooking tahong or mussels. Uh, they're Canadian mussels because that's the only mussels I can find in Costco. So we went to this Chinese restaurant buffet thing at Holland and um, I really like the way they cook their mussels. Their mussels were humongous compared to these mussels. But um, so I imitated the way they um, cooked it. It closely resembles how they cooked it. So I'm assuming they put um, uh, oyster sauce, oyster sauce, see right here, oyster sauce. So the best thing about cooking it with uh, lots of um, uh, water you make a broth I love the broth and the broth is so delicious during the cold season and right now it's you know cold so hey so um, see this right here these are cut cut up ginger lengthwise and um, uh, onion and then of course I don't have fresh garlic so I used um, what kind of garlic did I use? A uh, garlic powder. No, which reminds me I have diced dried garlic powder. Maybe I should add that. Maybe it'll add a little bit flavor to it. And I add of course a teaspoon of um, uh, black pepper. Tons of garlic powder. Maybe a tablespoon. I don't know. I didn't measure. But my kid is hungry and um, she will love this broth. Uh, I put a little bit of a dash to Mrs. Dash. But okay. Bye. So I added the um, diced uh, dried up um, garlic. And hey, look, it looks beautiful. And if you could taste this thing, it's delicious. Well, to me, it's delicious. Broth, a new way of cooking it, rather than just, you know, the old way, plain salt and, um, uh, what do you call this? Ginger. No, that's the way I was thought to cook it, but hey, it's nice to venture out, you know? And you never know what kind of flavor you'll discover. So, I guess this is a Chinese version of cooking it. Anyway, because I imitated from a Chinese restaurant. And plus I use oyster sauce. It's Chinese. da di da di da Anyway, okay. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.